Hi guys, this is Brittany. This is my final post for our CIP Roundup. So my tutoring was done through Boosburg College. It's a two-year private institution in Boosburg, North Carolina, about an hour north of Raleigh. Um, I did graduate from there in 2012. My learning objectives were leadership, teamwork, technology, initiative, supervision, and evaluation through the ACPA, NASPA, um, intermediate level is what I was hoping to really achieve there. The leadership and teamwork I really did achieve um, in both the avenues that I really tried to do with the tutoring. I did both physical tutoring in the academic tutoring center and online tutoring with the online tutoring platform that I helped create for the summer. Um, with the leadership and teamwork, I worked with the two um, amazing UNCW students, Samantha Pendergraf and Krista Rhodes. So I helped to kind of lead the charge, so to speak, um, in creating that online tutoring platform since I was the closest to Lewisburg College um, and had coordination um, with my supervisor who knew exactly what the students needed since she's over peer tutoring. So it was teamwork and leadership in that way and definitely touching on technologies. I have been very um, familiar with forums throughout probably about the past 10 years, um, but really putting the script in and finding all of these problems and being able to solve them myself um, was a really big deal for me. Um, so I did take initiative with really advertising for these products and I'll kind of get into that in a little bit where it was a challenge. Um, but the supervision and evaluation came in with the tutor to T relationship that I developed in the Academic Success Center in particular. Um, and I do feel like I really met the intermediate level um, and I really felt like I received a lot, a lot of guidance from this program. So I did do Monday through Friday, 5 to 9 p.m. after I worked from about 8 to 5 every day. Um, I worked in the Academic Success Center most nights. Um, I tutored in English mostly since that's where I'm most familiar. Um, but I also, near the end, um, decided to help with the mathematics section. Now we did have other tutors who I also worked with with teamwork um, and with supervision and evaluation, especially on the writing skills since I do have really high um, writing ability, but the mathematical ability, not so much. <laughs> um, we had an engineering major from NC State, of course, um, come in and she was absolutely amazing. And the students really, really did love her work, but there was one of her and, you know, it wasn't very busy during the summer, um, as I'll touch on in a second, but there would be about two or three students in there and one of her. Um, and so one night I decided to help her and <laughs> go to one of the students and attempt to have them work through the problem. Well, I was wrong on the problem, and she did point it out um, and said what I instructed the student to do was incorrect. I um, mean, instead of using that as an opportunity to really be I'm upset with her, I'm professional, or even to ignore it, I decided to turn it around as a teachable moment um, to the student and show them that I'm an adult, this is something that I should know, it's applicable in X ways to the real life situation, um, and this is something that I should know as an adult, and since I didn't pay attention, apparently enough, I learned it, but didn't pay enough attention to it, um, it's something I don't know now, and so we really kind of worked on one another. Um, me and the other tutors on our strengths and really learning from one another in that way. So it was a very, very big success for me in that way um, and also a bit of a challenge. I also helped construct the online tutoring platform called Kane's Best Track. Um, the discussion forum was the main piece of that with the private messaging so it would go from the 2T to the tutor. I'm in a very private matter. Some students can be intimidated um, by the Physical Academic Success Center and so we definitely wanted to provide a resource for them and a resource off hours um, because 5 to 9 at night you might really not have much flexibility there but during the weekend you might be able to get online and post or really reach out to that tutor. Um, so it was free to use upon registering and we had a whole list of resources. We had an introductory video where you could really go step by step in registering. Um, I created a 21 page um, guide booklet and then kind of realized the students aren't like me. They don't want to read a huge guide booklet. Um, and so I made a um, kind of one page quick sheet um, with those facts on it. And I will definitely try and attach um, at least the guide book <laughs> um, for you guys to kind of glance through. Um, but one of the biggest challenges was the fact that we only had 99 students during the summer. Lewisburg College only has about 750 annually, so a small school. Um, but with implementing in the summer, we really didn't get any response 
when we reached out and did a little bit of marketing for the online uh, tutoring platform. And so we really decided to, to gear it more toward a pilot version um, where I really got resources ready for the peer tutors who are going to take over this fall. So that'll be exciting to continue my role in guiding and supervising and evaluating these peer tutors as they take over the resource. I'm going to make it into something that they can use, that the two T's can use, and that they could all really benefit from. And I have a screenshot here um, of just a few of the forums and just how it looks at the moment. And we probably are going to take away the um, actual division of the courses since there are so many you know courses outside of summer school we have about maybe 10 15 20 at most um, courses during summer school but obviously a lot more during the year um, but this is just an idea of exactly how we broke everything down finally going forward um, I have learned a very great deal in all of these skills and I definitely plan to apply them I just recently learned that I'll be teaching for the very first time this fall um, a developmental English course and so I definitely hope to give those students the very best that I can um, and in that way really touching them with all the skills that I've learned and be able to give back in that way that's very important for me um, I learned through my experience with math tutor and just working with the students that to be vulnerable with them and to share with them you know your struggles and to share with them the fact that you can see that they're trying and that they have so much potential is really important to them um, and so I felt like this um, internship really did drop that home for me and made me more comfortable with being able to discuss with students and really guide them in that way. Taking on that leadership role was the, the really biggest thing for me. So I have gone over, I know, um, but I can't wait to hear about all of your internships. I know that they were really awesome and I can't wait to learn through you guys. Um, I hope you're having a great summer and I will talk to you soon. Bye.